the Nomura jellyfish, one of the largest in the world. They can grow to over two meters wide and weigh more than 200 kilograms. Drifting through the ocean since before the dinosaurs, without blood, bones, or a brain. Billions are now heading into Japanese waters. Their giant bodies gracefully float through the oceans. But these jellyfish devastate ecosystems and they're lethal to the local fishing industry. No one knows why Nomura blooms are increasing. Is it global warming or man-made pollution? Swarms that happened every four decades now strike nearly every year. Can science prevent jellyfish from taking over the oceans? It's very difficult to stop this jellyfish. They can survive forever. And this is where the journey began, near the mouth of the Yangtze River. It's here that the conditions are perfect for these mini monsters to breed. Low salt levels and a high population of zooplankton combine to provide an ideal nursery for baby jellyfish. A single giant Nomura jellyfish has over a billion eggs. Minute fertilized larvae attach themselves to the sea floor. The larvae then matures into a polyp, growing small feeding tentacles to catch passing plankton. What happens next is incredible. The polyps move in a walking motion, leaving a trail of tissue in its path. This tissue develops into more polyps and multiplies. The population explodes into trillions. <laughs> 